those guys fighting um, each other, you know, our sport is is like that. No, you know, sometimes you gotta you gotta do what you gotta do to um, you know get to the next level. And if that means fighting your teammate, then uh, it's something you gotta do. I think it could have been it handled a little bit differently. I think that um, you know originally that wasn't the plan for him to fight uh, Diego, so they wanted to switch things up. Um, so I mean, it, it came like rather like off off the wall. I was like. You know why? Why are they going to fight each other? But you know, obviously the coaches had a plan, and, and you know they they thought maybe that they can get the win that way. Garbrandt, no wins. What do you see from Cody? How's he dealing with that? He's obviously getting like, really stressed out. You know, um, I think you know after after this episode, he's just like, hey, you know, we you got to keep the morale up because you know on other shows when people like you know are losing this many, it's kind of like everybody. Kind of just falls apart, you know, and just starts, you know, partying, drinking, not going to practice. That's something that Cody instilled in us every day was, hey, you're here to you're here to work and get better, not just win the show. Yeah, our time, um, you know, we didn't win, so you're you're coming to get better, learn new stuff every day. There's a chance that somebody can get hurt. There's so many different possibilities, and and that's one thing Cody instilled in our heads and and um, kept our morale like up high you know we still were, were training just as hard and having a having a good time and, and um, enjoying the moment usually I'm the kind of guy like on that, that just stands back and like hey man they're, they're two grown men if they want to fight let them fight but at this point it was kind of like it got a little ridiculous you know everybody's you know so it was kind of like do we want to sit here and have them fight and sit here for another hour should we just break it up get them apart from each other so we can move on to the next uh, part of the day you know so it was definitely getting kind of annoying but um it was kind of interesting too, being right in the middle of it we just found out this week is maybe his fight with tj could be off it's not like totally 100 percent sure. called off yet but i mean knowing that he has to go get back surgery have you talked to him at all about it yeah you know what that says a lot about cody's um you know his integrity and just like how you know how tough mental toughness he is is, is any other fighter could just be like oh you know i'm can't fight, you know, but Cody's doing everything in his possible way to, to uh, get better and, and um, fix this problem so he can fight. So that's pretty cool. Um, he's in, you know, he's in Germany right now and he's um, getting the stem cell it's done on his back. I've been talking to him a little bit through uh, Snapchat and stuff and, and it sounds like things are going well. You know, that doctor out there is, is pretty legit. You know, he's helped a lot of people and he's helped a lot of great athletes. So. Um, you know, we're just praying for him to get back healthy and get back in the cage. And, and uh, he's not looking for an easy way out, obviously, because, you know, he's in Germany right now trying to get this stuff fixed. So um, I wouldn't think he's looking for a way out. So, you know, he it's probably just a little setback, but it's something he's dealt with before. So, you know, he's going to come back stronger.